One of Jupiter's largest moons is called Io, and it also happens to be the solar system's most volcanic object. Io has continued to surprise experts since it was first discovered about 40 years ago, and a new five-year study of this moon reveals details that prove it's even stranger than astronomers originally thought. Scientists set out to create an atlas of sort for Io and started by setting up highly advanced telescopes atop Hawaii's Mauna Kea mountain and recorded observations from 2013 to 2018. And those observations are strange. Published in the Astronomical Journal, this large data set uncovered new hotspots and bright eruptions, and altered earlier theories about the locations of Io's volcanoes. Previous models predicted that more volcanoes should be seen near Io's poles or equator, but that's not the case at all. In fact, no model seems to explain why Io's volcanoes are laid out the way they are. The study also showed the brightest volcanic eruptions seem to occur most frequently on just one hemisphere of Io. And here too, the reason for that remains unexplained, the scientists said. They did learn a bit about Loki Patera, which was already known to be Io's most active volcano. The telescopes recorded 113 hotspots here over the five years. And in a separate analysis of this specific data, the scientists say it could be possible that Io's orbit is what's affecting Loki Patera's volcanic activity. But they caution more observation is required. It's a mystery experts are drawn to keep exploring, as Io's volcanic activity could tell us more about ancient eruptions that happened here on Earth. And yet, every new observation seems to come with new questions about this strange moon. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.